Hi, I'm Dr. Vali from LMS Wellness. Welcome to Bizarre Beauty. I'm going to talk to you about all things cosmetic dermatology and medical wellness. If we have identified that the problem in your skin is laxity, then there is no point putting lots of filler to lift up all the looseness that is happening in the lower third of your face. So as you age, naturally, the fat pads in your face migrate downwards. So this fat pad moves down to here, this fat pad moves down to here, and this fat pad moves down to here, which causes a little bit of jowl and loss of definition in your face. You result in hollowing here and a fold here. This is all natural aging. There is nothing wrong with it. However, remember when I said about contouring your face, what we want is we don't want this kind of look, but we do want definition in our facial architecture to still look fresh. And the way to do that is to identify the problem. And if the problem is laxity, true laxity, where you have folds and loss of definition, the solution is not fillers or hyaluronic acid or fat transfer because that volumizes you. Fillers should be used to contour. Something else should be used to treat true laxity. And the things that are used nowadays are something called thread lift. Now it sounds scary, but it sounds like a thread is going to your face or it sounds like a mini facelift. It's a simple suture that's been around for a very long time in the same way that you have stitches. And what happens is we lift your face with one simple thread from one entry point to one exit point in different techniques. So we can do a pull there or we can do a pull there to actually allow the skin and the fat pads to move back into the direction where it should have been. And then afterwards, we come and contour. We build on top of the foundation of the house. We contour the face correctly to get the definition correct. And then finally, we paint the house and we clean your skin. How do threads actually work? The threads actually work by causing collagen stimulation, but more importantly, they do something even greater than that. They move into the lower layer, into just around the fat, and they cause a reaction or a stimulation to produce more collagen, more elastin, more fibroblast activity into this layer, so it causes a tightness. And the thread itself resorbs like any natural absorbable suture. So actually take a video of yourself to identify, do I have looseness or laxity in the lower third of my face because the fat pads have moved down? And it's not something you should be doing at a young age. This is something as you age above 35 onwards that we're looking at. So I tend to move away from when young girls come in, especially some of the models that have come in and they've asked for threads because it tightens your face completely because we can use other techniques to tighten your face. So a thread lift should be used in someone who has true fat pad migration causing jowling or pre-jowling, heavy folds and loss of definition. Lift your face correctly and then contour it. It's a simple procedure, but it has to be done in expert hands who's done it, someone who's done it routinely and someone who can identify putting the threads in the correct anatomical place because if they're put in the incorrect place, they can slip and you can have adverse effects. When I have those patients that come in and they say, I'd like some fillers to lift this area, I have to explain and go back to basic anatomy and tell them what is happening and to move those fat pads with threads or different technique first and then contour them correctly on the right anatomical plane and then paint them and give them makeup free skin.